You tuned in to Nita's TV. Come watch me, baby. Come follow me. You tuned in to Nita's TV. Come watch me, baby. Mom, I'm about to go to the store. I'll be right back. This damn early? Yeah, Mom, it's 10 a.m. The store opened at 8. I know what time the damn store open. I'm just saying you've never been to the store this early. Why now? Ma, yes, I have. I'm about to ride my bike to the store. I'll be right back. Okay, but when you go to the damn store, make sure you get me a Pepsi and bring me some damn salt and vinegar chips, please. All right. Good morning. Brittany, I know you heard me say good morning. Say it back. That's rude. situation that happened with you and my mom and just make peace with the situation sweetie i know that you didn't want to harm me you only did what your mother told you to do right now okay i'm gonna get up and open the door for you okay If she wants to talk because she's been giving me the silent treatment since you guys left, but you can try. All right, I'm gonna try to talk to her. Okay. <laughs>
was just trying to talk to you and you came and pushed me first. You're a liar. So you came all the way over here just to talk to me? You came over here because you wanted revenge. That's why. Wait a minute. I'm confused. Mommy, you told me you wanted to make peace and talk to Britt. Roseanne, I did. I tried talking to her. So she kept getting mad and pushed me and that's how we started fighting. I know damn well you've been getting my calls. When you get this damn message, call me back. It's your damn mama. Both of you, calm down. Brittany, that was not okay for you to push her. You're a fucking joke. I told you what the hell happened and you're still going to take her side? It's not taking my side, Brittany. Right is right and wrong is wrong. Exactly, Mumu. And Brit. You've been getting out of control, so I'm honestly not surprised by this. Ah! And what are you going to do with that? Huh? What are you going to do with that? Tell me. <laughs> really, Brent? Stop talking to me. How does it feel? Girl, stop talking to your mama like that. Please tell her, Mumu. She just doesn't care about anything. Who the hell was talking to you? Girl, I don't care. You being disrespectful <gasps> and all she did was ask you a question. I'm just glad that someone understands. Brittany, you need to learn <sighs> how to control your anger before it gets you well, in a lot of trouble. You guys, stop it. That's not necessary. I... Mom, get her off of me. Mom, get the hell off of me. Dumb. That's why I'm gonna let you get beat up. Keep get the hell out of my room. Somebody's angry. what damn store you went to. I don't give a damn. The damn store is up the damn street. It don't take no damn body that long to get off. I know your ass better be coming home walking in this damn door in the next five minutes. I tell you that. Getting on my damn nerves. Well, she's just worried about you. You should really head home. I know, but I'm tired of her treating me like a kid, and it's like I can't do nothing without her calling me a million times. I understand, but like I said, she's worried. You should really head home because I don't want any problems. I mean, I know. I'll leave in a minute, but I only came to apologize. I wasn't trying to fight Brittany. I was just trying to talk to her without her being upset, and she just got in my face. Mumu, I totally understand. You don't have to explain anything to me. I know my daughter, and I know she's always upset. She's always angry. There's nothing that anyone can do. Okay, Roseanne, thank you for listening and forgiving me. No problem, sweetie. I know that you mean well. I know that you have a really good heart. And yes, thank you for stopping by. And tell your mom that I said hi. And I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Okay, I will. Bye, Brittany. Get the hell out of my room. Girl, I just wanted to say bye. Blow me, bitch. Get out of here. And I made it now. See you, Roseanne. Okay, sweetie. I told you. Girl, I'm so sick of her damn man. She gonna keep worrying me, though. I bet you that. 
Let me call your ass back. Okay. Mama, bring your ass in here. And bring your ass in here right goddamn now. Where the hell you been at? Ma, I went to the store. It don't take nobody that damn long to go to the store. Why then? Ma, it was packed. Did you at least get my damn Pepsi and my salt and vinegar chips? Well, Ma, they didn't have no Pepsi or no salt and vinegar chips. I did, and I'm going to go inside your motherfucking head. Ma, why you got to keep throwing stuff at me? The same reason why your ass keeps standing there lying. I did it because I wanted to. Don't question me, little girl. Ma, why you keep trying to control me like I'm a kid? I'm serious, Ma. It's not fair. And I'm serious. Get your ass out of my damn room. So what if I tell you I'm not leaving now? Okay. Okay. What's that shit you were saying? What was that you were saying when I was in the damn bed? Ma, can you please get out my face? I'm not going no damn where. Make me get out your damn face. Make me get out of your damn face. What you want to do? You think you grown? You want to fight or something? Is that what the hell you want to do? Is that what you want to do? I know you hear me talking to your ass. Okay. 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 Well, okay, you done lost your damn mind. You done lost your damn mind. You can get the hell up out of here. Get your ass out of here. You think you grown? You can pack your shit and get the hell out of my damn house. And make sure you get all your shit. Don't leave nothing in this goddamn house. You don't stay here no damn more. Any damn kid that want to put their hands on their damn mama, they need to get their off. And I mean that shit. Touching my damn wig. Now I got to fix it to see what the hell is going on. Mama, you going? So where the hell you going? Ma, you told me to get out your house, so I'm about to leave. Who the hell you think you talking to? Did I tell you to fix your damn mouth? You need to get your damn respect off. You put your damn hands on me, that's why I told your ass to leave. Now, am I wrong for that? No, no. And you ain't got to slam my damn doors. You do not have to do that. Ma, can I please get that? And where the hell you think you're going with my house keys? Here you go, Ma. Thank you. Yeah, I closed it. What the hell you about to do? Ride the bike? Yes, Ma. You fix your face? Somebody got time for all these damn wanna be grown ass kids and they damn attitude. Daddy, can I come and stay with you? Why you can't make room for me? But I'm your child. She put me out and I'm tired of being here anyway because she always wanted to control me. Okay, whatever. Girl, let me tell your ass. Why the hell did that girl put her damn hands on me? I would lie to you. Girl, she done put her hand around my damn neck, called me a whole ass. She said she wish I was dead. It hurt me to my damn heart. I ain't gonna lie to you. And that's what I said. I said, when I'm dead and gone, she wish she wouldn't have did no shit like that. Exactly. Yeah, I told her to get the hell up out of here. 
Because any damn child that want to be grown need to be on their damn own. Simple as that. Okay. Okay. Instagram at A N I T A underscore L A S H A Y underscore. And you can also add me on Facebook, Auntie Comedy. Yeah, do that. Bye.